Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I love you for hearing me. If you're first time or welcome, if you're watching me, welcome as well. Thank you for watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. I really do appreciate you guys. Hope your day is going well and your family is staying safe and healthy. So today I'm here to talk to you guys about scripture that I very, very much like to read. And it's been a blessing to me just by reading it. And I'm pretty sure it's going to bless your heart as well. So we're going to be reading from the scripture, Galatians 6. Nine nah, it says, let us not be weary and well driven for in due season we shall reap if we faint it not. Okay? As I'm going to um, proceed to 10. As we have therefore opportunities, let us do good unto all men, especially unto them who are of the household of faith. Okay? So God is um, clearly telling us that not to grow weary in well doing and we will reap if we do not faint. Do not go worry in helping people. Do not go worry in doing good to your loved ones. Do not go worry in doing good to people that are around you that need it. Okay? Always be a blessing because God has blessed us for us to be a blessing. So do not ever go worry in doing good because God is going to bless you and you're going to reap what you have not sown just by being a blessing to others. Okay? Always be there when people need you to be able to bless others. God love a cheerful giver, as the word of God says. So do not go worry. Continue to do good. Continue to bless the poor. Continue to provide for those that are lacking. And God himself will open the floodgate of heaven for you and bless you and give you more and more and more than you can ever ask or think of. So never grow weary in well doing. Always be kind. Always be good. These last days, people are hurting. People are suffering. People, we need each other. We need to love, love each other. We need to help each other. So always be there to help your loved ones. Always be there to help those that are out there that I need. Help the poor, okay? That's the heart cry of God. To help the poor, okay? To provide for those that are less fortunate and that in need. If you have more than enough, be a blessing to others. And God will always bless you. And God will always make sure you don't lack. God love a cheerful giver. As he give, he will give you. As he bless, he will bless you more abundantly. So never grow weary in what doing. Do not get tired of being a good person. Do not stop giving because of the way you're being treated by others. Because your reward is from heaven. It's not from men. God alone will bless you more because of your good work. Okay, guys? So do not go where we are doing. Continue to be a blessing. Continue to favor others. Continue to open doors for others and God himself will open doors for you. So I just want to encourage you today to continue to read that scripture, Galatians 6, 9. Do not grow weary in what we're doing. Okay? Do not stop giving. Do not stop being a blessing. And God will not stop blessing you. Okay? God will favor you. God will make sure you have more than enough. You know why? Because you're